Hey, today I'm going to show you how to apply our eyeshadow for a go-to natural look. The eyes are truly the windows to the soul, and the right eyeshadow can accentuate your beautiful eyes and make them sparkle. This look is fairly easy. With a little practice and understanding of the three shade eye application, you'll quickly be a pro. Our Eco eyeshadows are rich in pigment, super natural, and are formulated with 65% certified organic botanicals, like organic acai and goji berry. I'm going to use three eco eyeshadow shades, a light feather, a medium stencil, and a deep still life. I chose a neutral palette to show you today with shades that look great on everyone. One of the big takeaways here is the underlying principle to the application. To get the dimension we're looking for, you'll want to choose a light neutral shade that's a cream or a light pink, a medium shade in the color of your choice, and a deep shade that's complementary to the medium shade. While you are applying your eyeshadow, really look into your eyes and fill your body with the awareness of your magnetic, beautiful being. Now close your eyes and send this message of love and gratitude out in the world to everyone you know. Right now, I already have all the makeup that I'm going to wear today, except for eyes and lips. I generally apply my eye makeup second to last and my lips last. I like to adjust my lip color to whatever creatively happened on my lips. To prep my eyelids, I've already applied my Perfecting Under Eye Concealer to my entire eye area to brighten. I've also applied our Total Cover Concealer in Canvas to set the stage with a creamy matte color. I've also set this area with my setting powder in Translucent. I'm going to apply lightest to darkest, starting with Feather. Using our Vegan Oval Eyeshadow Brush, I'm applying the shade Feather all over my eyelids, upwards towards the brow bone. You'll notice that your special eyelid shape will reveal or conceal certain colors. Play around with your own application technique. Respect the borders, the corners of the eyes to the eyebrow. Blend to achieve an even application, and then blend again. Now for the medium shade, I've chosen Stencil, which is a neutral taupe brown with a round blending brush. Apply the medium shade to the outside upper eyelid in a triangle, blending towards the middle. You'll be taking the shade two-thirds of the way up the eyelid into your crease. Ultimately, this is a gradation. You shouldn't see any hard lines. Blending is key. Applying the deepest shade will give your eyes intensity and depth. I'm using a deep chocolate shade called Still Life and my vegan crease brush again. Dip the brush into this deepest shade and blend into the outer one-third of your eyelid into the crease. Now line your lashes with the same deep shade to really allow your eyes to pop. We're using this tight lining technique in lieu of a pencil eyeliner. Line the upper lash line with Still Life using your vegan angled liner brush. Hit the lower lash line with a pop of the same shade lightly on the outer third of the lashes as well. To bump up the intensity, use more of your deepest shade. To make it more subtle, use less of the deepest shape. And don't take this eyeshadow stuff so seriously. If you make a mistake, you can always wipe it off. So now you know the basics of applying an everyday eyeshadow look. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, please like and share this video and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to check out our other videos. If you're not familiar with Afterglow Cosmetics, check us out at afterglowcosmetics.com where we empower women to value their body and unique beauty through organic, natural, and safe cosmetics.